Hey yo! Yeterian and Sebastian are here again, bring you the guide for Asphodelos, the third circle. As you can guess, this is the third raid of Pandemonium in the Endwalker expansion, released in patch 6.01. Without further ado, let's get into his first mechanic. The boss will start a fight with a visual ability, Experimental Fire Plume. Either the boss creates one giant fireball around him, which means he'll hit the middle, or the boss shows 9 small fireballs spinning around him, meaning he'll create 2 AoEs spinning on the outer circle and then end with one hit in the middle. To dodge the spinning AoEs, first go stand in the middle and then move into the place the first AoE went off. Scorched Exhalation is a moderately hitting AoE. The next mechanic, Heat of Condemnation, targets both tanks for a tank buster. The boss will then cast Dark and Fire, spawning 4 black flames in the middle of the arena, and target 4 people for an AoE. Be sure to overlap your AoE with at least one fire to put the fire out. Rights in the wing, or lefts in the wing, will cleave the right or left of the boss for a 180 degree cleave respectively. The boss will then fly up and reappear at the side of the arena to cast the line AoE in front of him. The Phoenix will then turn untargetable and spawn two sets of two adds that have to be killed before he reaches 100. All four of these adds have a circle around them. Be sure to kill them spread out so that no circle overlaps another ad. If an ad does get hit by his own and another circle at the end of this phase, the boss will gain 100 charges and end the fight. During this phase, the boss will periodically hit everyone with Blazing Rain, a low hitting AoE. But be sure to heal up as this phase ends with both a moderately and a heavy hitting AoE. From now on, the boss will also be able to cast Fledging Flight, spawning 4 Fledgings around him, one after each other. These will cast the corner Louis towards the middle. To dodge this, simply go stand behind the second one and wait for the first one to go off, after which you walk behind the third one, ending up dodging all 4 AoEs. Be sure to spread out after, as the boss targets everyone for personal AoEs. Devouring Brand will cause flames to creep up and split the arena in four. Be sure to not stand in them or get hit by the AoE they do after. And that's where this guide ends. Thank you for watching, have a wonderful day, enjoy your Final Fantasy XIV experience, and until next time, bye!